Alright, let's do this. What's up, everyone? Empowered Q's here, bringing you some more League of Legends action. Off to uh, already a little rocky start here. Um, my game wouldn't connect for some reason, so I teleported back to lane. But we're going against Anastas. I really like Camille. I think if you really want to climb, Camille is one of the best uh, champs that you can play. So we're going against Anastas. We have lots engaged. Should be pretty good. So we went press the attack. That's pretty standard Camille stuff. Uh, so we're going to look to poke him out. Don't want him to farm too much. Ooh, he did a good job there. So we took a W for the early poke. Uh, what you want to do with Camille is utilize her shield. So you don't really want to engage when you don't have that active. Um, and you want to... The way her Q works is there's two mechanics on it. Where you hit it once and then it takes a couple seconds. And then... Like that, boom, look at that damage, woo! So that's how you want to do that trade. Now he has to definitely back up. Uh, once we have our E, we are definitely looking good. He went Dark Harvest, which is really weird. So don't, like I said, don't want to give him any free minion action. I want to get, uh, you know, minion blocked by everything too. Perfect. Oh my god, I missed it. That's how you want to do that, though. I prepped up my Q, engaged with my E. Perfect. The world is not black. Yeah. Nice little poke there. I think we might be able to dive in. Perfect. Okay. Easy peasy. Good job by the Rengar. Push this wave in. He's gonna teleport. Oh, he's gonna back. Ideally, I'd like to get my Sheed here, but a little bit too early for that. So I'll probably start building towards my Tiamat. Uh, standard Camille build is Trinity, uh, Ravenous Hydra, and Sterix. I'm gonna go like this, grab this, and this. Good shit. I would have had enough mana if I got one of those kills, but that's okay. So yeah, wow, he's going super, super passive. So yeah, we want to keep bullying him. Yeah, like I said, he went Dark Harvest, which... Interesting. I didn't even have to burn my flash for that either. Cool biz. But yeah. Camille just gives you a lot of roaming potential with her E. You do a lot of damage. The alt is great for locking down pesky ADCs. So there's there's a lot of good stuff you could do with her. Got it. So this is going to push out some Mia. Back that up here. I don't want to let him free stack too much. So that's extra heal right there. So I still want to engage without the shield. Get some extra damage there. We got the shield to protect us. Perfect. Cool miss. And your sheen proc pro uh, goes off the Q too. So that's one of the reasons why you want to go sheen first item is it helps you do a lot of extra damage there. Mm, I can push this and look to roam. Healing, especially if I plan on roaming. Oh my god. Yeah. Definitely gonna roam on DTF. I have my flash if I need it. On my way, check the wards. Don't kill me. Perfect. 
Nice push into wave. Use the ultimate to dodge out the guard. If you didn't know, if you ultimate, you it essentially makes you untargetable. So if you were to card me there, it makes it so I can't be hit. So I'm going to finish my Tiamat and start building towards my Trinity Force. Grab this. Grab boots. And... I'll grab a attack damage. I don't need to teleport here. Even minion wave on his side. Cool. Done a little bit on CS, but that's okay. I gotta play this a little bit more passively, uh, cause he has ultimate and I do not. See, how's his stacking going? 90. Yeah, he's gonna be dangerous late game. All right, probably just gonna hold this under tower. Back up. I want to stand in that. Can't get that one. I think I get it. Yep, got it. Good. Never mind. Awesome. Nasus is going that way. I'm gonna push this wave in. Punch the roam. Nasus is mid, so I wanted to da damage to the turret. Okay. Um, your uh, Q strike doesn't work on tower, so it does the extra damage there. Let's see, Nasus is losing out on all these, so I'm only get a ward down. This is going to slow push back out to me, so. That's gone, I might be able to fight him. Oh shit. My guard's coming. Oh. Oh. I mistimed my uh, Q on there, so don't do that. <laughs> Works out alright in the end. I still don't have enough for my sheen. That sucks. What an awkward buy. Guess I'll just finish my phage. Grab another control ward. I don't know if I have to TP or not. Yeah, I think I do. I really wanted my sheen earlier than this. It's not ideal to do this on Camille, but... Going for that big one shot damage and asses. Okay. Don't know where he's going. Yeah, Rift Herald. I gotta keep this close. Boom. That's how I look at that. Want to get those three procs so I'm to press the attack, prep it up on a minion, knock him with my E. Easy peasy. An enemy has been slain. Uh, just chill. Stay out of that range. It's going to slow push out to me, so. This slowly last hit. Prevents him from stacking, which is really my whole goal. 
And then he actually keeps the push to me going if he uses that to farm. Because it hits all the minions. Okay. Stay chill. Pushing this. There we go. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just gonna make a run with my ultimate. Mm, I see Rengar. Not Rengar. Um, Shivana. Get some deep vision here. Is the TF pusher? I don't think so. He is. Right, I don't know if I kill him or not. I don't think I have enough. I want to make the roam though. I'm not going to make it. I want to start walking down at least. I'm going to start walking down at least. They're pretty low. Might be able to do something here. Oh my god. Ooh. Get it. Get it. Got it. Oh, triumph. Save me. Got it. <laughs> I got silenced out of my alt. I got greedy. I wanted to kill the Soraka first and alt the Jinx, but it worked out in the end. I could finally build my damn Sheen, too. So happy day there. Okay. We go Sheen here. Um, not great, but I'm gonna sell that. What boots do I want? Gonna go with Ninja Tabby. Reason being is, if you look at their forms of CC, uh, gold card, which I just have to be good and dodge that out or use my ultimate for. I don't really think I'm going to be the primary target for it anyways. Uh, traps, which I think are avoidable. Um, same with her stun. Which is like the little AoE orb if it sits in there. Cool. Get down to Dragon. And then his Wither. So I think we're gonna be okay. Shivana. Oh. Okay. That works. On my way, Rengar. On my way. Why do you keep pinging me? I don't know. <laughs> he should have gone back in. I was ready to kill him. Oh well. Cool, got that. Yeah. Missed. Yeah, he's going Dark Harvest plus Q, so he does a lot of damage, so he is going to scale very, very well, and he's going to hurt. Okay, push us in. So like I said, your Sheen goes off the uh, tower, so watch this, it'll be a huge damage, boom. I don't think he's coming from mid. No, okay. He used ultimate before, so... Let's see, look at that. Another good trade like that. Should be good. Okay. Ah, shit. Damn, I missed my uh, E. My bad. Misjudge the range. Cool. Gonna, yeah, come with Rengar here. Like I said, we gotta watch out for Nasus stacking because he is going to be super strong. Oh, me? Thank you. Such a swell guy. Okay, yeah. Nice, good shit by the Rengar. 
Good stuff. You just get so much CC with Camille with your E that pretty much three kills. Especially with someone like Rengar, I could have him uh, just once I lock him down, Rengar could kill him even if I could. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I have no health left. Ooh! Go Rengar, go! <laughs> I have so much money. I finish that, get my ninja tab, I'm gonna complete my my Hydra and then I'll go for Sterix. That Rengar. <laughs> um, I use my ultimate because like I said before, it'll stop stuff from hitting you, so it negated the tower shot. Saved my butt, flashed out of the Jinx auto attacks. Happy day. Alright. So always think about what your next objective is. We need to get mid tower down, so I'm gonna come this way. Um, and then I can start making my way back towards top. Yeah, probably bad. Okay. Use that anyways, but I'll take that. If he comes too close, I'll just kill him. Don't get the big damage there. Perfect. Gotta go kill the Nasus. <laughs> Worf. <laughs> All right. Oh, he's got righteous glory now. Huh. I don't think that's gonna help you, buddy. him down underneath the tower and keep getting my proper two proc so like I said it's one then you wait and when you hear that little sound hit it again so if you look at the damage difference it's what gives you the second one um, increases bonus damage by 100% and 88% of it is converted to true damage so especially with it gets the tankier target like Nasus it's gonna help you do a ton of damage E if someone's here. Make sure I don't get hit. And that's why something like Sterix is so good on Camille because of the, the Sheen proc. So I'm not sure how good it's going to be after the changes. I'm really bummed that they're doing that, but... Nice. Cool. Yep. Reset for Baron. I can teleport here if they need it. Yeah. Gonna grab. Oh, I can probably just sell this. I really probably should have just done an extra wave, but I can go like this. Grab a control ward. Reset Baron. That's what we want to do. Cool. Let's see. But yeah, if I didn't talk about the runes at all, try uh, pretty standard stuff. Press the attack because you have the true damage anyway, so. You don't really need Conqueror. If you're going against a bunch of tanks, if you really want to, you can. But I do really believe that uh, Crusty Attack is better on Camille. Um, Triumph, pretty standard. Bloodline, because it's good to give you some extra lane survivability. Same with Coup de Gras, gets you some extra damage. You got it. And then, I usually take pretty standard resolve stuff on Camille, um, bone plating, chrysalis. Like I said, just to give you more lane survivability. No point in killing Nasus. Just take the tower. Lock her down with my E. There's three of us here, she just can't defend. That's why, like, if you ever see me on a split push and there's, like, four people at one tower and I don't go to defend, it's because three against, four against one, you're just going to die. There's just no point. Like I said, I can do one of those where if he tries to yellow card me, if I use my ultimate, it can't hit me. 
makes you untargetable. Baron. Sometimes ambitions must be restrained. Let's do Baron and end. Two damage proc. I think they've given up. 6 0 and 6. Not too shabby. Grab this wave, they could go dragon. Oh, they got it. Look for them. Wow. Push this turret in. Uh, like I said, my, my goal is to build Sterics next. More survivability. And then you would go traditional tanky stuff. Like if she was more fed, you could go Randolin's Omen. Um, so you gotta keep in mind that you're gonna be uh, jumping pretty head first into the battles with your ultimate stuff like that because Camille is such a good engager. Ah! <laughs> Excuse me. Woo. See what I mean? Good stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, I mean, the engage and disengage on that is just insane. I was all the way over here, like. Yeah, like I said, if you really want to climb, Camille is definitely one of the best meta junglers right now. As much as I love Jax, it's so good. There's so much you can do with her. Especially, like, imagine with teleport plays bottom and stuff, and just alting them and locking them down. It's just, it's just crazy. And I think she's super solid. I don't think... The stare exchanges are honestly going to affect her too, too much either. Um, it might take down a little bit of her Q poke, but hopefully that's not too bad. The other option that you have too is if you're in an unfavorable matchup, Camille is very versatile, where you could take Comet instead of uh, press the attack, and you can go with a W poke. So if you have to first pick something, uh, instead of getting hard countered as Jax or a different other champion, you can pick Camille and really be good into almost any matchup. And that's one of the uh, difficult things about laning against Camille. Ooh, almost. Almost. Is she's very versatile at what you do with her. So you can take Comet uh, or do Press the Attack and be more aggressive. Her shield also scales. If you didn't see, because I know I didn't talk too, too, too much about the shield, is you auto attack, the shield activates. And if it's, if it's orange, it's physical damage that's blocking blue magic damage so like i said she kind of works for whatever champion you need to uh it's really hard to gank her too because of her e so unless you use it aggressively can't get away well i hope you guys liked that one don't forget to like share subscribe let me know what you think uh if you want to see me do some different champions i of course will primarily and always be a Jax main and still do Jax videos but sometimes i like to switch it up so let me know your thoughts well thanks again for watching like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to check out my Twitch info. Come hang out and chill while we record. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.